Hello dears, good morning. It's me, Ms. Lindsay, your English teacher. Nice to meet you again. Okay now, welcome to the world of English. So, before we begin, let's ask the blessings from God, the Almighty, so that let His Holy Spirit enlighten us, help us and guide us through. Dear children, Today we are going to study a new poem from our course book, Honeysuckle. Beauty, penned down by Yeshua, which is a short but beautiful and meaningful poem. In this poem, beauty has been defined and the poet says that beauty is there in everything. Now, let me introduce you to the poet. Yeshua was born on 9th September 1926 in America. She was a poet and an educator. She is also known as Blue Corn. Now, we will move on to the poem. Beauty so, dear children, before we begin, let me ask you a question. Yes, then tell me, what do you mean by beauty? According to the dictionary, beauty means a combination of qualities such as shape, color or form that places us. It is also the quality present in a thing or person that gives intense pleasure or deep satisfaction to the mind. Children, now we will see some pictures which are very beautiful. Children, how do you feel when you see these pictures? Yes, you have become very happy and excited because it gives pleasure to our eyes and mind as well. Right? Yes, that's it. So here in this poem, we have three stanzas which tell about beauty. In the first stanza, the poet talks about the beauty which we can see. In second stanza, she talks about beauty which we can hear. And in third stanza, she talks about the beauty which is internal beauty of a person. Now, we will move on to the first stanza. We will read it together. Beauty is seen in the sunlight, the trees, the birds, corn growing and people working or dancing for their harvest. Here the poet says that beauty is everywhere. It can be seen in the sunlight. It's there in the nature, in the trees and in the flying birds. Beauty is there in the growing crops and people who dance to show their happiness when their crops are ready. Now we will move on to the second stanza. Let me read it for you. Beauty is heard in the night. Wind sighing, rain falling, 
or a singer chanting anything in earnest so here it says that beauty is not only seen but it can also be heard or felt so there is beauty when night falls there is beauty when wind blows and there is beauty in the sound of rainfall or when a singer sings and there is beauty in everything when a person do it honestly children we will move on to the last stanza we will read it together beauty is in yourself good deeds happy thoughts that repeat themselves in your dreams in your work and even in your rest here it says that beauty is not always external or visible beauty is there within ourselves too there is beauty in our good deeds and in our thoughts our dreams are also beautiful and there is beauty in everything that we do and it says that there is beauty even when we are at rest in short everything is beautiful in its own unique manner but we should be able to understand and feel it children hope you could follow me so now it's time to wind up the session today i request all of you to like and subscribe my channel thank you